Today we're going to show you Dexter's self-adjusting electric trailer brake assembly for the right hand side. Part number 23-451. This is a 12 and a quarter by 3 and 3 8 inch brake assembly. We'll measure the diameter across the shoes and there's our 12 and a quarter inch mark. Then we'll measure the width of the shoe and there's our 3 and 3 8 When paired up with the left hand side, these brakes are good for axles rated at 9,000 and 10,000 pounds. The assembly uses a 7 bolt mounting pattern. So check your axle and see what brake mount flange you have. The brake assembly also comes with a pair of wire leads that you use for your electrical connection. It doesn't matter which you use for ground and which you use for your brake feed, so long as you have a good, solid electrical connection. As these are electric brakes, you don't want to use them on boat or marine trailer applications. This brake system is also self-adjusting. You'll still need to adjust the assembly when you first set it up by rotating the star wheel and getting the proper amount of tension. You want a light, even amount of drag as you rotate the drum around the shoes. In the future, as you back the trailer while applying the brakes, this cable system will pull an activator which will automatically advance the star wheel to keep the proper tension. We know that this brake assembly is for the right hand side because we want the short shoe facing the front of the trailer and the longer shoe facing the rear of the trailer. The way the brake assembly works is as the drum rotates around the assembly and you apply brakes inside the vehicle, this magnet is activated and it will stick to the inside of the hub drum. As the drum rotates around, it's going to drag on this magnet that will pull this arm and then ultimately open up the brake shoes and apply brake pressure. And that does it for Dexter's self-adjusting electric trailer brake assembly for right hand side. Part number 23-451.